In our other top story, a controversial migrant housing plan for Chicago's northwest side was the subject of a court hearing this morning. Our Sean Lewis is live in the Galewood neighborhood with details on the arguments from both sides. Sean. Yeah, Pat and Zena, neighbors here in Galewood and in North Austin were hoping to have some answers after this morning's emergency court hearing. Unfortunately for them, they were not getting any answers, at least not yet. The judge says from where she sits, because migrants are not being moved in here to the Amundsen Fieldhouse, uh, that this does not constitute an emergency. Uh, what we do know from this hearing this morning is that the city said that it does not plan to move any migrants into Amundsen or any other location around here for at least another seven Seven days. That is giving a little bit more time for the attorney for the neighbors who has been trying to get this temporary restraining order issued by the court to stop the migrants from being moved in here at all. Now, community members say this field house at Amundsen Park serves as a safe haven for youth and for seniors in regard to programming. The park district says that they have moved those programs to other neighborhoods and people can go there. But community members say that is a public safety issue, asking kids and for seniors to go to other neighborhoods with which they may not be familiar. To take our park is very disrespectful. Our park is supposed to be used for the people in the community, right. for our young people, for our seniors, for our youth, for our sports program. Our mayor has been radio silent. We see him all around the city, mm -hmm. smiling and cheesing and giving speeches everywhere. But he has not one time, one time come here to talk to us. Again, for now, everything is on hold, at least for the next seven days. The city says it has no plans to move migrants in here, though they have shut down programming at Amundsen Park and also moved in some porta potties into the park. For the neighbors, they say that is a clear indication that Amundsen is their selection. The city and the park district say they are still looking at other facilities in the neighborhood. For now, neighbors say they will remain vigilant and be ready to go back to court if they say see any movement of migrants into Amundsen Park Fieldhouse. For now, we are live on the city's northwest side. Sean Lewis, WGN News.